Hi, and welcome to this unit of the Open SAP course, Delivering Value of Intelligent Innovations at SAP s My name is Yong, and I am from the SAP s Co-Innovation and Product Success Frontrunner team. And in this module, we will be covering how to kickstart the journey of AI adoption so that you can get started quickly with the adoption of intelligent technologies within your enterprise. So without further ado, let's get ready and let's begin. So as enterprises execute on their, on their digital transformation strategies, there may be certain challenges which they will face in terms of adopting the latest and greatest technologies. Firstly, a key challenge for CIOs and IT managers is how they can actually manage the transformation of core processes while yet reducing complexity and increasing efficiency. Another challenge for IT managers is to also understand the relevance and applications of these intelligent technologies, such as conversational AI or machine learning, and knowing what skills are needed within the enterprise to realize the value out of it. For example, a key question for any CIO before embarking on adopting the technology could be, do we already have a data science team within the organization who can actually help us understand the value of applying machine learning, such as some use cases um, or proof of concepts, or do we actually need to invest in training and recruiting the right skill sets? Simply put, IT managers face a constant challenge between keeping lights on and adopting the latest technologies into their landscape just to stay ahead of the competition and yet at the same time fulfill expectations. Which brings me to my next point. If all these challenges are actually so great, why should enterprises innovate in the first place? Some of the common goals for innovation adoption, which we understand from our customers here at SAP, is to improve business process performance, lower operational cost, and also increase employee satisfaction and productivity. Of course, all these to build a competitive edge. Enterprises are also looking to build solid, future-proof capabilities in the organization. This, of course, motivate them enough to embark on their innovation journey, despite the challenges which we earlier described. And okay, so all of that sounds really great. And now we're actually motivated. So where can we actually start? So to start, SAP s itself is a great foundation to start with. Enterprises can start first by identifying relevant use cases that can be addressed by technologies such as robotic process automation. For example, the automatic uploading of supply invoices to address a manual process bottleneck. They can further build the skills needed to help them further realize the value out of all these innovation goals, such as learning how bots are built to apply extensions and even combine them with machine learning solutions so that they can actually address an end-to-end -end use case. To help you visualize it better, you know, let us all imagine the enterprise as a, as a living person. By doing so, this is how the different technologies will fit the enterprise. In case some of you find this familiar, yes, you may have already seen this slide in an earlier module by one of my colleagues. So in this, let's, let's all just go deeper into it. Here's a description of some of the intelligent technologies for SAP s hana that enterprises can actually leverage as part of their innovation strategy, which we'll now cover in detail. So first up, to address the growing needs for faster and better decision-making, SAP data intelligence, including machine learning, can actually help users with proposed solutions inference using available data. For example, would be um, you know, payment advice extraction, where machine learning can actually help extract data out of a PDF and actually post it into the system. If you scale this across hundreds of documents, this capability actually becomes extremely valuable in helping the organization to, to make more processes more accurate and yet more efficient. While also working within SAP s hana system, SAP s hana Embedded Analytics, as its name suggests, also informs users within the same environment and provides them with key business process information such, and metrics such as cash liquidity or day sales outstanding. This way, business users can make decisions in a moment without delay. To accelerate business processes, um, SAP Intelligent uh, RPA can also play a huge role to automate manual and repetitive tasks for users at scale. For example, uploading hundreds of supply invoices automatically. Tasks, you know, by doing so, this actually frees up the employee for higher value task. Situation handling for SAP has for HANA can also help proactively inform key users on critical events and recommend actions that need to be taken, such as invoices, skip on payment advice. This way, actions can actually be taken immediately by business users or even in the future by bots, minimizing delays to the business. Lastly, as technologies mature, an exciting new field is conversational AI, where users can interact with systems such as SAP s HANA using natural language instead of the traditional point and click, with chatbots that can actually answer common questions or even interact with digital assistants that can actually help retrieve an invoice. This really helps accelerate processes. So all that sounds very cool. How can I start? And this is where we would like to introduce to you the business innovation frame, framework for SAP s for hana 
The Business Innovation Framework, framework for SAP S4 HANA gives customers a standardized guidance on embedding innovation and adopting existing intelligent technologies, including future and customer-specific innovation. All these use, uses the SAP methodology along the following phases, discover, prepare, explore, realize, deploy, and run. What is provided is uh, basically uh, product-related content to actually help customers to enable innovation adoption and also innovation stream SAP S4 HANA engagements to leverage the expertise of SAP services. More importantly, this framework helps, helps you get started quickly in adopting innovative technologies and also ensure consistent innovative, innovation strategy within the company, beginning with the product to implementation and all the way down to enablement. Lastly, this is also a way for enterprises to also implement and validate or even co-innovate on cutting, cutting edge use cases together with SAP. Here's how you would, get, you, you would actually get started. Step one. At SAP, we will help first to define your innovation ambition by aligning on the strategic intent and business priorities, as well as, as on innovate, innovation domains and fo focused processes. Next, we will work with you to drill down on end-to-end -to -end processes, discuss findings based on a tailored analysis, and, and also understand where the most effort is currently required in your SAP system. This can be done using a variety of tools, such as the Business Scenario Recommender and, and SAP Spotlight, in order to estimate the automation potential of each process. Step three is where you can work with, with experts in SAP in a workshop to leverage your findings and to evaluate, map, and prioritize innovation opportunities. The goal here is actually to help you develop an action plan and an, and an innovation roadmap, which would then be handed over to you with uh, prioritized intelligence scenarios that can actually be included into or integrated into S4 HANA project plans. It's also important to know that not all journeys need to start from scratch. So customers are definitely free to start wherever they are along their journey. Using the example of finance again, customers can actually start by adopting existing best practices, such as the bot for automating the uploading of remittance advice into SAP S4 HANA, which is now available on the SAP Best Practices Explorer or in the Intelligent RPA Bot Store. Customers can also build further on their foundations by going beyond point solutions or use cases. By analyzing usage data within a process, such as accounts, accounts receivable, Customers can also can help identify or discover other uh, other automatable processes beside the first example which we, which we just described. For customers who have already adopted best practices or have a strong innovation strategy as a foundation, they can go even further by extending into cutting edge use cases. With the different technologies which we described earlier, the greatest value can be realized when you begin to combine these technologies together into larger use cases such as late payment risk assessment, which combines RPA and machine learning together. The Business Innovation Framework for SAP S4 HANA is designed exactly with this flexibility in mind to support customers on whichever step they are along their innovation journey. So, as mentioned previously, analyzing usage data is the first step in knowing where to start. For customers on SAP S4 HANA or SAP ERP, the SAP Business Scenario Recommendations and, SAP and Spotlight by SAP are two, some, are two very powerful tools to actually help identify processes that are highly manual or complex, which can be addressed by automation. For customers on SAP S4 HANA Cloud Essentials, there is also the SAP S4 HANA Cloud Releases Assessment and Scope Dependency tool, and the SAP Usage Analyzer tool along with, SAP's, along with the service for, for SAP Preferred Success customers. You can find out more by visiting sap.com or reach out to your SAP contact. To give you a sense of what will be analyzed, we will dive right now into one of the tools on the next slide. So Spotlight by SAP is a powerful new process analysis tool to actually help analyze data from SAP S4 HANA or SAP ERP. With 300 processes out of the box, the tool allows comparisons with industry benchmarks. For customers, this allows them to analyze internal process complexities, such as how many users are involved in a process and how much manual effort is required. All the data is then mapped to an SAP S4 HANA Cloud best practice process standard to allow for transfer, transferability and comparison between customers. These all come as part of the, of, the, of the Spotlight report, which is currently free as of this recording. What's coming up is also more exciting. So with Spotlight Enterprise plan as a cloud, cloud subscription, customers can further explore and understand detailed user interactions through user behavior mining and a continuous monitor, monitoring of trends. This helps customers not only to focus on relevant KPIs, but also drill down into end-to-end -end processes and get recommendations on where to improve. You can find out the latest developments for Spotlight on the website below. So in summary, adopting techno intelligent technologies with SAP S4 HANA at the core does not need to be a difficult challenge. The business innovation framework for SAP S4 HANA was designed to, to give customers a standardized guidance on embedding innovation 
and also adopting existing intelligent technologies all within the organization. This is so that you can, you know, as an organization, get started quickly in adopting innovation, innovative technologies, ensure a consistent innovation strategy from product to implementation, implement, validate, or co-innovate on cutting edge use cases with uh, SAP, and also maximize the return on your SAP S4 HANA investment. If you would like to learn more or get started, please reach out to your SAP contact person or to the Frontrunner team at frontrunner at sap.com. You can also embark on your innovation adoption journey too by checking out SAP Activate or get started on your own with the various intelligent technology scenarios and best practice content that are already available in the SAP Best Practices Explorer. So with that, I thank you and I hope this topic was insightful and definitely I will see you on the discussion forum for all your queries and until then, bye.